at the end of my journey, I can see through time, my eyes blinded with tears. I see the star of our hopes, the Emperor who once brought peace and prosperity to our house, who built a powerful empire and united tribes from all walks of life. I see an epoch of overall happiness, and now that all lies in ruin. The old gods had arisen. Brothers picked up arms against brothers. Mankind clung to each other's throats, ruled by a state of anarchy. And Mother Nature took her revenge by showering plague and famine upon us. Evil is walking in this world, leaving nothing but dead cities and pillaged settlements behind. The land is lifeless and barren. But maybe there is life on that distant, forgotten land, where only few once dared to venture, those whom we would once call madmen. You are one of these madmen now. What destiny awaits you? Will you find your way or disappear trying? Will you rise to glory or fade into obscurity? No one knows. Only time will tell. Hello, ladies and gentlemen. How are you all doing this evening? Welcome, welcome, welcome to our third VIP defense. Yes, that's correct. The third day of the VIP defense. Oh my gosh. <laughs> hello, Laurie. Hello, Fig Jam. Hello, Jacob. Hello, Algma. Hello, Harry. <laughs> hello, Mr. Scott. Hello, Mitz. Hello, Brandon. Oh my gosh. Third day, ladies and gentlemen. It's here. <laughs> so, for those of you who aren't quite up to speed, the VIP defense, what the, uh, so far what we've got is a distraction unit, a massive amount of Romans here, designed to kill all of my archers if they can now they do a damn good job of it and over here as you can see the main part of the defense these wonderful wonderful spearmen that you bought and a couple of mg42s are on the flanks as well wonderful stuff and the vip that you will be defending of course as always it's the wonderful lovely rexy i believe everyone called him <laughs> rexysaurus rex so, ladies and gentlemen, let's see if tonight, finally, we can finish our defense. Can we finally make sure the VIP is safe? Three days of warfare has commenced so far. <laughs> oh yeah, Rexy and Handman's. <laughs> oh, it was Hans Zimmer, wasn't it? Yeah, Hans Zimmer. <laughs> hey, Fat Fiend. Oh, I'm sorry if I sound uh, a little bit sniffly today, ladies and gentlemen. I am starting to come down with a cold. So, yeah, I do apologise. If you hear me sniffling and stuff like that, I know it's horrible, but... <laughs> so, we're already at our 40,000 kills. Now, I am afraid I cannot exactly... <laughs> Uh, remember now did we say it was a hundred per kill streak? I think that was it wasn't it? It was a hundred K for the kill streaks if I remember rightly. Is that correct? We were doing it every one hundred K for this one. Yeah. Excellent eh? Good stuff. Look at these, the Romans are still holding out here. This distraction force absolutely lives up to its name. Every 20,000. Nice try, Fig Jam. If you were going to do it, I you should have said 25. Because I would have done it in the, the minimum of 25 increments. Oh, I'm glad to hear, Mr. Scott. 
go have a look at our MGs. That always cheers everyone up. Watching these MGs absolutely light up the entire beach here. Oh my god. They're a little bit loud, but oh well. Look at all these archers here. That's it, they're starting to form the half moon. The entire first force here has been almost completely wiped out. The Egyptians pushing forward. I believe the correct term for it is sallying. Sally forth. Actually, at this rate, they might actually get to the archers before a decent line of... Uh, looks like the footmen are getting stuck behind the archers. The distraction technique working wonderfully here. Yeah, these actually might be able to get a decent amount of the way towards the uh, towards the archers. Uh, me and all of them, Big John. <laughs> I've had helicopters, Mr. Scott. Yeah, this defense is going really well for you guys. You might actually hit the 100k this time, I think. Has anyone seen All Quiet on the Western Front yet? I haven't watched it yet. Hey, Jake. How's it going, man? Yeah, I really want to see that all quiet on the Western Front. It looks really good. These Egyptians just getting <laughs> torn up now, quite frankly. This poor little flank here, they pushed out all on their own and they've now just been surrounded and are getting absolutely swarmed. Oh, guys, I've been experimenting with the Japanese uh, kamikaze unit in uh, Fall to Arms. <laughs> now, I can't get the AI to detonate them, but when they explode, my God. <laughs> I also found a uh, gore mod as well. So, yeah, you ladies and gentlemen should be in for a bit of a treat, the ones of you who enjoyed the Call to Arms stuff. The gore mod is pretty crazy. Are we thinking we're going to hit our 100k, ladies and gentlemen? What do you think? 25 years, Fat Fiend. There we go. This MG here. Uh, somehow, is he shooting... Why is he shooting into the side of a cliff? What an idiot. How weird how this side seems to fall first. That's really odd, yet yeah, it's got the three MGs on it. <laughs> I don't know what kind of porn you've been watching, Fig Jam. <laughs> Ha, <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, a palm, a palm. Got it, got it. <laughs> yeah, Harry, it's it's uh, it's a very distinct possibility. Yes, I have lost a heli, Mr. Scott. I got shot out the sky. I was flying at low level across the ground, and I got shot out somehow, and the helicopter crashed into the ground and I died. Where's my mind? In the gutter, as always, Fig Jam. I never pick up my mind out of the gutter. Me? It had me in it. <laughs> I consider myself quite valuable. A hundred and one years, Algebra. Oh, dude, that sucks. Yeah, man, it's just one of them games. You can't get attached to your gear in that game. Oh my, it seems like the tactic squad are at work again. Eighty seven thousand kills on the board. going to be a tough one guys 87,000 it's going to be close this is real close that MG is going to put in some work Uh, the kill streaks will be the standard ones. No, Scott, I didn't. Ninety-one thousand, coming up to ninety-two. It's getting close. It really is getting close. That MG's putting in the work here for you. <laughs> Here's a bloody T-Rex. <laughs> okay, Mr. Scott, enjoy.
93,000. Not bad. Get in there. Get in there. He's just got to hold out that little bit longer. I don't think it's going to happen, ladies and gentlemen. I think you're so close, but no cigar. Thank you, Mr. Scott. So, 93,934. Not bad, not bad. Your poll is now live, ladies and gentlemen. Go ahead and vote on what units you want to purchase and add to your defence. And if you haven't already, please do leave a like on the stream. It really does help us out. Thank you for the likes, guys. Very kind of you. Let's go ahead and end the poll there, then. So, it looks like we're getting Romans, and they're going to be added to the distraction unit. <coughs> so, the new total amount of Romans in the distraction unit is going to be 16,558. So, I would assume that you're going to get your uh, kill streak this time. Want to move MG on the left by the Rex into one unit. Want to move MG on the left and by Rex, right. MG on the left and by Rex into one unit down onto the next level down there. Okay, so what ones have we got over here then? That's the... I think that's purple. Pinky purple, this one. And we've got a black one over there, so I'll do that. Put that to there. Move these down onto here. Is that it? Hey, Kieran! Thank you very much, my friend. There we go then. Let's go and give that a whirl. So that got you an extra 3,131 Romans that round. So if I'm right in thinking, yeah, look at this. They actually now outspan my horde. That's kind of crazy. Look at that, they've literally just pretty much wiped out half of the archers. Luckily, the other half of the archers are all in here, inside the massive group of footmen, well and truly protected. getting the uh, next poll all set up so I'm ready to go when the time comes I do think you're going to hit your kill streak this time let's go have a look how are these MGs doing over here we appear no that's right yeah there's only two on this side, isn't there? Yeah, that's correct. Okay, so it might be better to move them up a little bit next time. Or maybe even over, bring them back over this side. Put them in front of this bunker, actually. That might be the best idea. What do you guys reckon about that? If we move the MGs over here, they'll have a much better field of, field of fire.
Look at that, they're just tearing into these guys here. I really like these MGs. They just tear open guys left, right and centre. Especially when you get some concentrated firepower in them. My god, they're deadly. But you, look, you can see here, this is all the work of the MGs. Just lit up all these poor fellows as they charged in. you got to think, from the angle that they're doing it at as well, it's not bad at all. distraction force over here still distracting well and truly i think it's just yeah the last few are here oh it does look like the last few of the distraction force have just been killed here we go again this flank has been cleaned out Oh, he's getting some lovely strafing fire on the beach there. To be fair, the range of these archers is quite far, isn't it? I mean, look how far they're shooting. That is quite far. They're shooting it over here. Over here. I don't know what that was. Yeah, these guys are having a bit of a field day, aren't they? Stop muskets in this one, uh, Harry. Sorry. <laughs> Not a bad idea, Laurie. Yeah, your kill streaks are spawn 10 MGs, 5,000 modern troops, 250 exploding arrows, all five tanks. Now, I know what you're thinking. Why is there only five tanks but 250? explosive arrows that's because the tank can literally do that it can tank a lot of fire like it'll be able to hold these in place so much longer than the explosive arrows they die really quickly when they get targeted so yes while you do get a lot of them the uh, the offset is that they're very weak if they do get targeted so yeah that was a uh spawn 10 MGs, 5,000 modern troops, 250 explosive arrows, or 5 tanks. Nice little push out here. You can tell where the MGs have been putting in work. Hey, we're having a field day up here. <laughs> uh, gotta love the accent.
Ladies and gentlemen, a proper little blood lake here, born from hardened combat. That's what I like to see. The lovely blood lakes. <laughs> Wading pond. It's the, the kids paddling pool, that's how we describe it. Kids paddling pool. Then you start getting towards the, you know, the teenagers one over here. No, this is still a kiddie one actually. This is one for the kids still. Love them MGs in the background, just leveling fire into the backs of these guys. <laughs> yeah, that's a mature wave, a uh, mature puddle of blood. Oh gosh, keep going up there to look for these guys, but they're over here, aren't they? These guys will be racking up kills at the moment. Oh, here they come. And there they go. The MGs got overwhelmed. And yes, congratulations, ladies and gentlemen. You did ascertain your kill streak for the round. <laughs> Let's watch the VIP's defense now. You're at a hundred and thousand four hundred and ninety two kills. Not bad, not bad at all. Maybe one day in my attack wave, I should have. Uh, I think it came from some ostriches earlier, Fig Jam. Maybe in my attacking wave, I should have the MG 42s. Uh, modern soldiers, Mets. So the kill streak was spawn 10 MG 42s. Spawn 5,000 modern troops, spawn 250 explosive arrows, or spawn 5 tanks. <laughs> I know how old we're, innit? <laughs> like Emu War flashback. Now, if you're wondering why there's 250 explosive arrows and only uh, five tanks, as I said before, the tanks can take one heck of a punishment. They could survive on... they'd still be down on that beachhead now. Indeed, 5,000. Really, over the 10 MGs, that is surprising. And over the 250 explosive arrows. 5,000 is a lot. But so is 10 MG 42s and 250 explosive arrows and 5 tanks is excellent for a distraction unit.
think of them five tanks down on the beach, how long would they survive compared to the Romans? You think? Ah, okay. You think 5,000 will kill all of them? I mean, you think 5,000 modern soldiers can take on 25,000 arrows? There we go, ladies and gentlemen. 106,005. So your poll is now live. Get a vote on what units you want to add to your defence next. Should be quite interesting here. Go ahead and add that bomb. So it looks like we're buying more Romans. Are they being added to the distraction unit? Are we adding these guys to the distraction unit, yeah? So, the new total for the distraction unit, 20,091. Let's just trim them a little bit. Oh gosh, you can't trim them that much. 3.5. Five. There we go, that one will do. So let me go ahead and get the uh, pole ready for the kill streak. Do, 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 do. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, your kill streak poll is now live. Go ahead. Vote on what superpower you want to use. been ruined very close let's go ahead and then that, that, that then 5,000 modern troops have been added to the battlefield where do you ladies and gentlemen want them I know Jacob Plex said it's rare that we ever get 100% on here. 
You <laughs> move the men down. Ooh, okay. You want them over here? In a single line, on guard. Let's see, how long can we stretch this before it gets ridiculous? Eight will eight do you? Will that eight do you? Yeah, I don't want to get it too close, otherwise they might start spawning in the boats. And it's difficult, you'll start losing units, because I'll have to try get them in between the... Might be able to get it down here, actually. No, we'll try this. There you go. That's probably about as close as I can get them. Let's go give... Yeah, everyone happy with that? Give this a whirl. Let's go watch them. Here they are, the bad boys themselves. Get to the shingle! 30 seconds! Private, move right. Jenkins, move left. Keep moving. You sit still, you're a dead man. Or oh, duck or oh, emu. Oh my god. Oh my god. Come on, emus. Take the brunt of it. Let the heavy knights advance. This is brutal. Oh, the knights can't catch him, but the emus certainly can. I mean, the knights are catching him. we doing over here with the distraction unit this is holding out strong to the waves of archers here yeah definitely putting in the work aren't they Yeah, I think you might actually clear out the waves that come in off the boat with these guys here. Oh, I didn't miss. No, sorry, I forgot. Remind me on at the end of the round if, uh, if there's an end of the round. Come on, emus, get there. That's it. I'm no longer calling these ostriches, I'm calling them emus for the, uh, the benefit of the Australian viewers.
<laughs> How we doing over here? Wow, well, ladies and gentlemen, look at that. The distraction unit has been going on so successfully now that you've pretty much managed to kill the entire front wave here. And the good thing is, them MGs there, well, yeah, let's just say these archers here are probably actually not going to die to modern troops. I'll put it that way. These are probably going to get lit up by the MGs more than anything. They are getting surrounded now, though. So I think that's it now. All the wave is spawned in. Tell you what, these heavy knights can take a hell of a beating, ladies and gentlemen. They've rounded up these lovely, lovely 5,000 modern troops like cattle on the beach and are now just proceeding to start slaughtering them. Don't get me wrong, it's costing me a hell of a lot of men to kill these. Wow, we're coming up to possibly our second hilt streak. How are we doing over here? Yeah, so it looks like the archers have once again split in twain. Half of them are trying to deal with the spearmen over here, the other half heading over here. What are the arrows bouncing off? Are these armoured? What are the arrows bouncing off? No way, these are armoured now. Okay, I didn't know that. That's a new thing that they've put in the update. These are armoured. Since when have these been armoured? They never used to deflect arrows. They didn't used to deflect arrows, though. Oh, shit. Well, that was unaccounted for in my calculations when I said 5,000. However, congratulations, you attained your second kill streak, ladies and gentlemen. No takey backsies. <laughs> I don't think. Uh, I don't know if there's going to be a takey backsy at all. I actually think you might even win here. There is a possibility. I mean, it's going to be hard, but there is a possibility you guys can actually win here. There is only a hundred thousand left to kill. You have still got the MGs up here as well. It depends how much work these archers put in. As you can still see, there's a heck of a lot of the archers left alive. Hey, Chris! The spearmen are taking on the archers, though. We've got to kill as many as they possibly can before these footmen come back. the love in this part now just absolute field day for them oh we've made a salient this is always deadly when they make a salient like this often in salients the most troops die as you can see here look this is a salient and everyone's dying that's weird it's like a double one
Yeah, I think you will lose. But you say that, J Jacob. Technically, it's gone on for three days. So... <laughs> We've already almost been going an hour. I believe, like, a lot of uh, the big YouTubers and stuff like that, some of them only stream for a couple of hours a day. So. Hey, boy. Hey, girl. Hey, boy. Superstar DJ. Here we go. Sorry. I don't know why that song popped into my head then. Of course, Laurie. We'll have just a, a little bit of chaos before we go. create some blood tsunamis on the new map. Yeah, it's the Battle of the Bulge. <laughs> Ooh, looks like the MG42 over here has finally been engaged. And they're just absolutely shredding any portal that gets close to it. My god, them poor infantry just absolutely wrecked them. See, that's why they cost a hundred thousand, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> Wow, 231,000 kills, guys. 88,000 remaining. You've got to be pleased. You've got to be pleased with that result so far. That's been one hell of a kill count. See, it's when they get swarmed, that's the problem for the MGs. They're really good at a distance, but when they get swarmed like that, they just, they can't cope. Here we go, the VIP defense now. I wonder what you guys are going to buy next. I wonder what you're going to get with your kill streak. In fact, let's just... Uh, now it's all cleared out, let's go have a look what the, the carnage was. Oh my god. I wonder where they made the last stand. Can anyone tell where they made the last stand? Do you think it was over here? No, I don't think it was over here. I don't think it was over here. Could it possibly be here? Do you think they made the last stand here? Yeah, I think they made the last stand here. There's a few little clues. <laughs> oh 
couldn't quite whip them with them there broomsticks. <laughs> what is that accent? It's such a weird English accent. It's like on Hot Fuzz, I think that's where most people would have seen that accent. The farmer who, who's got like the, uh, the the sea mine in his bloody shed. He's got all the guns. <laughs> oh, Laurie, that would take forever. I love how he moonwalks every now and then. He's holding out, isn't he? He's definitely holding out. These Romans give him such a long lifespan here. Yeah, the ostriches are quite powerful in this. They're really good at closing that gap on range units and flanking positions. There we have it, ladies and gentlemen. Let me go ahead and take a note of that. Two, three, seven, six, four, six. And your poll is now live. Go ahead and vote on what units you want to add to your defence next. Ooh, yeah, and I'll move them MG's mitts. There we go, they should have a much better field of fire there. I just need to be right back a second, ladies and gentlemen, while you guys vote. It won't be two minutes. Sorry about that. I'm back. Oh, that's a good point. Dave hasn't been on. Or Olympic. Yeah. So, let's go ahead and the poll there. 
MG42s. Yeah, Dave's probably still asleep, yeah. So, what's going what where? Spears on attack. Oh, we're getting bold. We are getting bold. So, where do you want these uh, MG42s, guys? Oh, you want all the MGs in one unit now? Probably best to leave them where they are. They'll have an absolute killing field up here. So, let me go ahead. Do I even need to do the poll for the kill streak, guys? Do you want just want the five thousand moderns, or should I do the bother with the kill streak? As in the vote, should I bother voting, or do you want me to just get you the five thousand? Yeah, poll. I'll poll it. Yeah. Then there can't be any question, can there? Play it safe. There might be silent people out there who uh, aren't as vocal, who don't want to go for the modern troops, so just to make sure we'll put it in a poll. Keep it fair. There it is. Now, go and vote on what you want to uh, spawn in. A few more seconds on that and then we'll end there. Right. Where do you want these? Do you want them adding to your existing ones? Yeah, existing. Adding them here, yeah. There we go. Let's go watch the massacre on the beach. Who's going to be the poor first unfortunate soul to get off a boat and get lit up? Definitely a massacre, isn't it? Uh, Paul definitely did show up. 
There was 15 people who voted Alderman. And there's only 21 watching, so I don't know. You might need to uh, refresh, my friend. God, you're actually out fighting here. That's bad news for me. How's the distraction unit doing over here? It's holding out for now. Yeah, these guys really did take the fight to them. How's the MGs doing? Lovely work here. God, they're laying some firepower down into the centre mass here. Oh, as soon as I come look at them, they stop shooting over here. Typical, isn't it, lad? Oh, no, there we go. Yeah, these guys are holding the beach no problem now. There's seven up there, Jacob. Let's go have a look, make sure there is. Yeah, there we go, seven. Oh my god. Safe in Private Ryan, eat your heart out. Well, I guess that's why they're called uh, kill streaks, glory. <laughs> One, just get one. This one here, this one man. We're following this dude till he dies. Oh, well, there you go, he died. <laughs> The army is now split in half. Half of them have uh, now they finished with the distraction unit. Half are going after the moderns, half coming over here to the spearmen. They just need to finish up these last few here and then they can push forward. Hey Olympic, just wondering where you were. Oh no, what's happened? Is it because you're nine minutes late? What's up, Olympic? Why are you so mad? Oh, mate, that sucks, dick. Mate, that is awful.
Yeah, I think you've... Uh, somehow you've cleared up the entire attacks force here. But yeah, man, I hope you uh, manage to get it sorted out or they, they find out who did it and you're able to get whatever you lost back. That... I hate stuff like that, mate. Awful. If you get it... Like... There's just no need. Any school stuff. Jesus. The word I want to call them, I'm not allowed to use, mate, because I'd get demonetized. But it's that word that you can't say on YouTube, the one that gets you demonetized. The one that begins with C. And that's what they are. Complete and automate. I'm actually quite surprised that these uh, archers here have got the range to take on modern troops. Don't you think that's a bit mental? That's the one, Jacob, yeah. I'm not allowed to say it, though. Not well, uh... Not well live or in videos. really don't know if you can actually win here. There's 24,000 of my troops left, but I think the majority of them are actually archers. So it depends on what happens with these modern troops here. Because you've got 10,000 troops left, and the majority of them are these modern troops. Uh, guys? Guys? Um, what? What? Oh, they're on guard mode, aren't they? They're on guard mode. That's why. That really confused me for a second. I was like, why have they just stopped? It's because they're on guard mode and they can't see any enemies anymore. Yeah, it just really confused me. Because they were, like, running and then just frozen instantly. Like, all of them all at once. Now, what the interesting thing here... Oh, my God, look. Probably should have set these to attack. <laughs> Look at these. Oh my god, they are just laying down serious firepower into these dudes here. Look at them, just getting mowed down. Oh my god. Where are these guys going? Mate, this is glitching out somewhat crazy. Oh, look at this. These archers here. These brave few, they're going to make a go of it. Archers versus modern troops. If the modern troops lose, that's going to be really embarrassing. <laughs> so what's going on over here? Let's have a quick look, have a quick skedaddle, see what we can see. Pretty much looks like them MGs just absolutely wrecked all the archers. Oh my god. Yeah, look at this. They're being shot at in the rear. The MG42s are attacking them in the back. They're getting shot at from the front. I don't think I've got any troops left over here now. No, this is it, ladies and gentlemen. This is it. This is what it comes down to.
Yeah. Literally the only thing that's won it for you was these guys here. And even so, I think I killed quite a few of them. I think there's probably six to seven thousand, maybe, at a push. Because you guys have uh, got quite a few uh, of these left. How many was here? There's got to be at least maybe a thousand here. Possibly. Or a couple of hundred. I don't know. I can't remember now. But yeah. There it is, ladies and gentlemen. Congratulations. <laughs> After seven and a half hours of combat, you have finally victorious and the VIP has been freed. Of course, Pinky always wins. <laughs> oh no, no, that's no, 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 no. Gotta do it properly if I'm gonna win. Sorry. <laughs> Victory to the pinky. <laughs> well, yes, ladies and gentlemen, look at that. What an absolute massacre that happened on the beach over here. Just like the asteroid all over again. Yeah, pretty much. <laughs> and all of the work was gone in an instant and replaced by sheer madness let's see how the VIP truly performs But look at them all coming down the mountainside. <laughs> ah. Yeah, Rexy's family's angry. Oh my, look at them sliding down the hill. What are they doing? Oh, look at this. Oh, they're attacking it as they're sliding then. That's brilliant. There's only 10 million heavy knights. That's all. Just 10 million. <laughs> oh, you've got to love it, ladies and gentlemen. The insanity that is Ultimate Epic Battle Simulator. Where in the world would you ever see heavy knights taking on dinosaurs? Oh, there we go. It started. We've started the bow wave. But we've got a proper one over here. <laughs> this is how the dinosaurs actually went extinct. Yeah, this is what they don't show you in the history lessons. <laughs> A pool of wine. 
<laughs> well, according to Resident Evil 8, if any of you are familiar with that, this would technically be wine. Lim Lady Dimitrescu's wine. Let's have a look. How's the blood pool doing on this side? Oh, yes. It's getting some proper bow wavage. <laughs> if you're a creationist. Yeah, I suppose. Look at this one, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, my. Oh, this one's so deep now that they're having to path around it. That's a good sign. That'll be drowning them. Oh my god, look at that. Moses may have parted the Red Sea, but the Red Sea parts the lesser demons. Run away, brave Sir Robin. He ran away so bravely, so brave Robin. <laughs> oh, yeah, absolutely have to love it. Oh, God, what's going on over here? This looks brutal. Oh, God, you do not want to be flung off the side of a mountain by a dinosaur. Yeah, so I'm definitely going to have to make a blood wave emoji at some point, I think. <laughs> oh, God, look how deep red that is. That is a gross deep red. Let the cleansing blood wash over us. Let it take with it our sins of our souls. Is it me or does that like get turned more and more into water as it goes further down? Oh, it looks like this blood wave actually finally hit the city. Yeah, <laughs> some people do Mexican waves. I do blood waves. <laughs> oh, absolutely love it. No. Boy, that's it. In the medieval times, this is a city. <laughs> In the medieval times, that is a city. Ah, oh, yes, of course, Mids. I didn't realise he had that level of detail in the game. Oh, my. <laughs> Fine, a, a Hamlet. <laughs> oh, my God. You know, there were some really small cities.
Well, ladies and gentlemen, think. I'm, I'm happy. I'm satisfied. We've let enough blood out for today. I was going to say, yeah, this isn't exactly small. Like, you've got to think, it's got an inner keep. It's got three defensive layers. That, to me, is a town. There's enough buildings and enough defences here for that to be considered a town. But yes, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to call it here. I do hope you had a blast. I know I did. A massive, massive shout out to all the channel members. You guys are absolutely freaking awesome. Thank you very much for supporting the channel and helping to keep it going. It's absolutely wonderful to have you all here. What a fantastic community this is. As always, ladies and gentlemen, I will be seeing you on Wednesday for the next live stream, 11 p.m. GMT, British time. Sorry, British, not British. <laughs> oh, thank you, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you very much. <laughs> Let's get one last nuclear wave in before we disappear. Oh, absolutely glorious. Thank you, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you have a wonderful week, and I'll see you all on Wednesday for our next very special battle. I've got something wonderful lined up for you. So, hope to see you then. Peace.